Okay, we're gonna talk about a topic like I guess rapping. Let's talk about Lil Wayne and Eminem. Ti, Ti, Ti. Honestly, I mean Ti and Lil Wayne both. I can't really say like they both got their own style, so it's like I really can't judge both of them together. Like who is better than the other one? I mean, I would say Lil Wayne got way more hits than Ti. Ti don't have hits because you can listen to Ti. Oh, you can listen to all Lil Wayne's music to this day, even his oldies, and it sound good. Ti has a lot of songs that you listen to, and it's just music. It don't sound like nothing anymore. False. He doesn't make legendary music. Who? I'm saying that with Eminem. I was talking about Eminem first because Eminem makes music. He doesn't make anything legendary. False. <laughs> He's not. Name False. a song that anybody listens to still this day that Eminem made in the past that you can jam in your car. Um, I was listening to Slim Shady and Marshall Mathers in my car today. So you still listen to Slim Shady on Max in your car? Yes, I do. I was in. I was in one of the groups live today listening to Eminem. Yes. I can name several songs that Lil Wayne has that is just legendary that you can still listen to and say, dang, this song still sound good. And you get the same reaction when you listen to before in the past. No, no. After Carter 2, I stopped listening to Wayne. So if I do listen to Lil Wayne in my car, it's the Carter 2, Carter 1, The Block Is Hot are the only three albums that I would listen to from Wayne. I don't know. I like legendary music. Like I can say, I can, if I can listen to this person's song in the past and to the day and be like, oh my God, this song's still mind-blowing good. That's a good, okay. that's a legendary name, song. Name me a legendary song from the Carter 4. Honestly, I have not, like, anything on for Carter 4. Name me a legendary song off the Carter But 5. I know his new, his new album, um, Piano Trap, is actually a good song, and it's pretty legendary. Name a song legendary off the Carter 5. Okay, hold on, you trying to go, name something legendary that Eminem made that was new. But we we talking about Lil Wayne and T.I. Uh-uh, because Lil Wayne honestly still make hits. Name a song that Eminem has made off that album that he just dropped that was good. Rap 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 God is a hit. Eminem has a white fan base, let alone a black fan base oh, in Mexican. Lord. So when we it comes get... to black people, when it comes to like Lil Wayne, of course the white community is going to support their own wow. more than they're going to support the other one in the hip hop. It doesn't mean he's exactly, they say they said that Iggy Azalea. Hey, made you so- better you songs like, than Nicki. You sound like Lord Jamar. Stop it. Stop no, it's the fact. They said Stop that Iggy Azalea made better music and she's a better ra- ma- rapper than Nicki Minaj because, of course, she had one song, Fancy, that was top. But she's they're trash. not looking at it. She's she is trash. trash. But if we was to judge basically off her, like, you know, hits because of her, her numbers, we would say, okay, Ilya, Iggy Azalea had a uh, higher number hit than Nikki did so she's a better rapper but it doesn't it's just because she has a white fan base and a black fan base she don't have no hits she only have fancy that's the did you guys remember when they said that Yazelia might be the better rapper than Nicki Minaj no no I can definitely go find it and screenshot it and post it in here no Nikki can actually freestyle right you're proving a point though G but okay. Nikki's fa- when it comes to white people, when they start to engage and stuff, they have they so when they have a white person, they put their all in support. Their community, their community supported them harder than ours do. Right. So let me ask you this: So why do white people like Nelly? Because Nelly made a country song with Florida on um, Georgia Line. He made like several country songs. I can name for one. No, before when he came out with Country Grandma, he had a white fan base. Right, because he nah, made co- he made music to support their culture, just like um. Uh, Darius Rucker make country music. White people love him because he's a black guy that make country music. It supports theirs. Okay, white people but like Wayne. They like Wayne. They like Wayne, but when it comes to their own, they're going to always put their own better than yours. That's the whole point. It's not because Eminem like is music. better than Wayne. <laughs> no question. Eminem is not better than Wayne. Okay. Did you listen to Wayne's new album? I did. It was terrible. Funeral it was not. Terrible. His terrible. album had, was very terrible. versatile. He had some of terrible. everything, different styles di- and different, like, you know, Eminem new album was Harry Bo. Nobody even played on the radio. Okay. None of his album made to the radio. Question. Let me ask you this. Who had the best verse on Forever? It doesn't matter about who had the verse best on Forever. Because I don't know if you're, you like Eminem. That's the whole point. But who, I'm asking you. Who had the best verse? In your opinion. She bodying you low key. Oh my God. You said what? I see you're bodying him low key below. It's Ooh. not body. I understand. I just feel like forever. if a black guy would have came out with them same words oh, that Eminem rap, you guys would have said he was trash. No, that's false. He would have not been as hyped as Eminem is right now. I can guarantee you that. Why? Because he's rapping about person, real shit. That's his life. It's not he's real rapping. stuff. How? If a black guy comes out and had them same Eminem, and Eminem never exists, and a black guy came out making Slim Shady, you guys would call him a goofball and say his music was trash. That's false. She right. Okay. That's false. She right. Y'all are buying. Right. 
Yeah, it's true. Because little Uzi Vert and all of them make goofy ass music. Y'all say, oh, this I don't listen to goofy ass shit like that. That's not real hip hop. But this nigga making Slim Shady talking about putting his ass in somebody's face and spitting in fries. And you guys think that's real music? That doesn't make any sense. Little Uzi Vert mumble rap. Eminem do not mumble rap. But Eminem's new I'm album was rapping so fast and it sound like mumble rap. No, he's telling, he's showing you I can do the same thing they can do, but better. It's not that be- better. I'm not, if I'm a rap, if I do hip hop, I'm not going to lower. And then that's another thing. He always focus on new and other styles. I don't give a shit. Whenever you ever see any other legendary rapper give like Jay-Z, don't give a fuck about, oh, I'm going to go make a diss track on mumble rap. They don't give a fuck about that. That's a lot too. Oh, Jay-Z Ben fell off. So why Jay-Z fell remember? off, but Jay-Z still got le- Jay-Z never Jay-Z can still jump on anybody's no, song he cannot. and no, drop he fire cannot. ass lyrics. That's just no, Jay-Z. He he can't Jay-Z has made his numbers. dudes. So he you really gotta compare off. Jay-Z to Slim Shady who oh, make goofy God. ass I'm I'm cleaning out my closet. Death of Auto Tune. Let alone all his diss tracks he made who he came from with people like Donald Trump. Apple Music, wait, wait, Microsoft, wait, 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 Gay wait, Community, wait, wait, wait. Uh, Benzino, when, irrelevant people. When you, when you listen, are you, when you killing you? When you listen to an Eminem record, are you listening to what he? Are you not listening? I to what do he's listen, saying? and guess what? Listen, so how I you dated a white guy, so I'm gonna tell you, trash. He's talking, I dated he's a white guy that was obsessed with Eminem, mom. and he lived that same life as Eminem. He was a little trailer park white boy. Had a little, him and his mom was beefing. He cussed his mom. I had no respect for her. Eminem make little angry white boys that admire black boys style music. No, That's all he, he makes. He, yes, he does. Putting music out that those for those. Yes, who he does. Eminem relate. make music for acid heads. That's what he make music for. Sorry, you can't relate to him. How can how can so you beating your mama up and trying to kill her and you got you want to kill your baby mama and do weird goofy shit. I, I relate to Eminem. Eminem make on, music that was singing I white boys to school and relate. shoot the school up. That's what he makes. No, he didn't Little say Andy that. He music. didn't say that. He No, he said, I blame it on, he said, y'all blame it on Marilyn Manson. Where oh were the my parents God. at? Where were the parents at? Sound like some white boy stuff. White boy stuff. Worrying about politics and, and government. And yeah. like not speaking politics. on nothing that it means nothing. Politics he don't never anything. speak on nothing <laughs> that means and that You the, hear her? He doesn't never speak about nothing that actually She's inspires hip hop culture. Uh, he speaks about government shit that has something to do with his no. culture. What the fuck does Donald Trump and uh, Microsoft got to do with us? Microsoft, you getting killed, G? And what does the uh, gay community have to do with us? That don't got nothing. What does Britney Spears and Christina Aguilera got to do with us? Well, he was dissing them as a rapper. Huh? Damn, yeah. Name name a single other than cleaning out my closet. You can't even name other songs that's on the album besides the singles. Okay, I'm Slim Shady. <laughs> exactly. You just know the singles. Clean it out my closet. Yeah, yeah. You he don't know Soldier. Hey, Seventeen you don't years know ago. You don't know till I collapse. Guess what? Seventeen years ago, niggas are still stuck on that era. Well, then it must no. be great, then, huh? Yes, they not, you cannot name not. You didn't name one new song. He had a whole new album. He had two new albums. Monster you didn't name one song Monster. off that album. That sound good. Monster, Monster was goofy as fuck. Wait a minute. Okay, so what do you like then? What what sounds good? Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Monster didn't even play on the black um radio station. They played on, on the white radio station, wait, a bubblegum wait. pop station with Rihanna and all of them. How would you know? Are you listening to those pop stations? Because I listen to that pop station, duh. Okay, so then you should like the Eminem stuff, right? And guess what? I cut that song off when I hear only time I like it with Liliana saying it. When Eminem came on there with that non rapping, uh, rapping off topic, beats not on the top. You like rap, rap, I'm talking about it gets cut off. It's his song. Like How is he not rap. rapping on topic? You can't relate. It doesn't talk. Did you? So you guys like Monster? You guys are there listening and meditating off of a good bubblegum pop music. I didn't like Monster, but I did oh. like the way you lie with Rihanna. I, I love like Monster. It. It's an amazing I like record. Rihanna. And it's Juice World's probably but, last hit. So yeah, I'm fucking with it. You. No, it was not a hit. It was goofy. It didn't it, sound better than what Lil Wayne just put out. Lil Wayne's whole album sound better than Monster. No, it doesn't. Lil Wayne's first song sound good. The, the, song? Um, the song first time on piano trap sounds really yeah. good. Have you heard Sight the song about the Las good. Vegas shooting? About the Las Vegas, Vegas shooting? Who from gives the, a fuck? From, Nobody, uh, what does that exactly. have to do with hip-hop? What does Las Vegas heard. shooting He's have to do you. with hip-hop? Uh, Wait, so yeah, about all rappers have to make songs about it hip-hop? It doesn't have nothing to do with hip-hop. Who's the club that have to do with hip-hop? What, what, nothing. What, what, what does selling drugs have to do with hip-hop? She can't name Guess a nine record. Guess what? Because people go up, people, people go up in lower any time, and they see these things. Eminem have not seen it. He see fucking so methods and acid poppers. Wait, so you think that people in the hood don't see people shooting? 
You think we don't? Uh, yeah, you can see people shooting. You can see people shooting in the good area. So, so, like, when Eminem raps about guns, are, are people in the hood not supposed to see that? I, I don't understand what you're. Implying. What do that? What? No, no, no. Ask the question. Las Vegas shooting. In fact, I think that was a country. That was a country uh, place that got shot. Up. A country concert. That was, in fact, a country concert got shot. Up. What the hell did I do with, with hip hop? Well, it's a rap song. It's called storytelling. It's, it's called. It storytelling. doesn't make. It, it, it doesn't inspire. Nothing that I care about. Wait, and in so fact, like, when our people really was out there, that was all his people out there that got killed. Cause that was a country festival. Right. Cool. So like, what that got to do with black people and uh, the culture that black people make, which is called hip hop? Is he supposed to make songs exclusively for black people, even though he's not black? He's not gonna make songs because at the end of the day, he's trying. He's I'm gonna make things. You're not that answering the question I'm asking you. You're just oh, responding. Oh, I'm gonna ask the question. <laughs> he's gonna make you think that he's better than every rapper that you guys create. Like he's a Adele. That has to do with his community. I'm, I'm sorry, I missed a bunch of that. You kind of cut out. Uh, I'm sorry. I say he. He's <laughs> doing it again. Am I the only person well, who's here? No, wow. I'm sorry. My phone's getting blown up right now. Ah. He's getting sent to ignore. But he's not going to speak on anything far as with, like, hip-hop culture because he doesn't know anything about the hip-hop, the actual hip-hop culture. He's going to, he know, all he knows is, okay, I know the rhyme music and it's rap. That's all he makes. He makes rap. Um, all right, so here's the thing, right? Eminem is, like, the biggest hip-hop fan in the world. Like, Eminem is a... He is not a hip-hop person. Just, just, just hear me out. Eminem is, like, really obsessive about hip-hop. Like, he, like, slides in little, like, uh, shouts out to like obscure 80s rap groups and shit. Like, he's really, really into it. More than I am, at least. And like, so I mean, so you think a white man is more into the hip hop that, you, that your ancestors created for you? How Absolutely. Like, I'm just not into 80s rap like that. He's been into it longer than I have because he's older than me. How do you how do you know that he claimed that's the same because time he called black girls niggers and all kind of other stuff? So, you, you really think you, he was inspired you, by it? Yes. Clearly hating. You clearly hating. <laughs> I don't. That's you the can't truth. admire that this man has talent, lyrical talent. He does not he, have talent. I'm saying that he, he yes, he can rap, he can rhyme, but at the, the so can Dr. Seuss. So can Dr. Seuss. But guess what? I wouldn't say that he can. He's he's have a, a huge influence on the hip hop culture because he's not. Ask he the hasn't rappers. on anything about hip hop culture. Ask the rappers. Ask these rappers buddy. First of all, half of these rappers, half of these rappers are gonna kiss ass because back in days when he would come out. That's when blackballing was all very popular. Uh, all right, so let's talk about the rappers who like that. him. Let's talk about the rappers who don't like him. Let's talk about MGK. Looks up to him. It's his favorite rapper. Joe Button, his fa well, not his favorite rapper, but he definitely Okay, had so a have you physically ever came for MGK back in the days other than coming from J uh, Ja Rule, Nick Cannon, and Benzino, and Trump, and Microsoft, and the gay community? I'm sorry, I didn't catch that question. So have he, name a person that Eminem asked, that actually had an issue with Eminem, that Eminem actually this. Cannabis. He body cannabis. On no. Sam Shady LP. Yes, he did. You never well, heard of the record. It's, no. it's like a bunch of records. There's one called Cannabitch. There's one called, uh, there's one on the Role uh, model. M show. What is that? Role what did you say? It's, it's, on, it's called Role Model. It's on Slim Shady. Yeah, like he, he's been okay, rolling so Cannabitch for a long time. All I'm saying is, if Eminem was a, a black guy making that music, you guys were fucking. Look at that for example. Bubba Sparks and Eminem, like, on the same era, and nobody really fuck with Bubba Sparks like that. I don't know Bubba Sparks like Eminem and Bubba I'm just showing really? as, I've shown an example. That, that's not no. a good example. Bubba Sparks is white. Like, you're not, com you're comparing the two. And thing. Eminem is white. So you think Eminem's black? No, Eminem is white and Bubba Sparks is white. So how are they different? Right. So They're why doesn't Bubba Sparks really have, did not fuck with why Bubba, Sparks? Bubba Sparks have the success that Eminem does if all Eminem's because success black is based people, on him white? Bubba Sparks did have one hit that black no, people like. No, he did. He had like three. No, it was trash. It was yeah, trash. Yeah, I give him, I had give like him three. three hits. He had Miss New Booty. Yeah, he he had, had, um, not even. He had one. He was a one-hit wonder. No, he had one before Miss New Booty. It was um ugly, I think. It was the shit with Timberland. That was it. After that, you and never guess, heard. And he had the shit with the guess what? Point. He guess what he did? He went out and met his. He went off and met his little white wife and went into the military and lived the normal country southern boy lifestyle. Who cares though? Like, why? Why does this bother you so much? It doesn't matter. He's not in nobody top five. Eminem is in everybody top five. Eminem's, Eminem's not in everybody. top five. No, he's not trash. I guarantee. I said rapper, rapper, every rapper. I never. If I get in my car, I'm never. Rakim put him in his top five. Stop hating. Well, I, I, no, I'm not hating. I will not. Even though it's not in my top five or they on don't my don't have What's your top five? What's your top five, Adele? I love, honestly, I like people like Lil Wayne, Trash. for one. I like Jay-Z. You say what? Trash? I said it. Trash. How do you man. call Eminem, who have not spoke anything? Oh I can, you can name, how do you compare Eminem to Jay-Z when Eminem music is inspired by Jay-Z? Make sense of that. 
Okay. Expired. Oh my god. Let's talk about uh, how so you how like you been trash. Because I don't like Jay Z, and Jay Z is like a huge sellout. But like that. But you don't even like eighties rap either. So I mean, how do you listen? Like let's 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 I don't, ha- I don't have a top five. Joe Budden got his whole style from Eminem. I said it. I just know if I listen to your album, I'm going to listen to all your songs and whatever ones I like, I'm going to click and save. If I go through Eminem's and that new album, I didn't click and save none of his songs in that album. Adele. At all. Adele, one question. But I have three songs of Lil Wayne on saving my album. Trash. One the question. Album? How do you put Jay-Z yeah. in your top five? A nigga that's known for stealing bars from Biggie, Slick Rick, Nas, in other Eminem, how and how do you how do you know that? Because we heard the house. How did you know that? We heard I'll show you that later. From. And I'll a lot of people, later. a lot of people in rap may tick and borrow stuff from like different rappers and lists and no, manipulate no, no, and put no, in their no. words. He that doesn't make. I don't see a problem bars. with that. He stole bars from other people. I don't understand how you guys Adele. can listen to right. that bubblegum ass rap and call that hip hop. What makes it bubble? Not All right, so how do you define hip hop? It is bubblegum. What what is bubble? Nah, 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 nah. That don't sound like go bubblegum music. Y'all see y'all caught blasting that shit on Max. I didn't. I don't listen to music. To if I see a nigga people? pulling that by my car, listen to some Eminem blast that shit, I'm gonna roll my goddamn window up. But like, I don't listen to music to impress other people. I listen to music I like. So like, how you guys? How, let me ask you a question. Do any of you guys ever live in the hood? Fam, I'm from Seven Mile. <laughs> so you live in suburbs your whole life, like me? No, I'm from Seven Mile, the red zone, four eight two zero five. Look it up. I don't know. We got to see if you really. We got to look at this background and see if you really live there. Yeah, that's like that's me saying I live in Compton and I never lived in Compton a day in my life. Hell, mm-hmm. I lived in the suburbs my whole life. It's entirely fine. I mean, like I, I haven't. So what's your point? You say you haven't. So I can't take. I cannot. In fact. You grew up around white people, so you probably been listening to that shit while your little white friends all your no, life. I w- no, I went to an all black. Yes, it is. Adele. Yes. How how do you compare Eminem to Wayne and Jay? Like I don't understand that. When y'all put that comparison is I cannot see that. Yeah, you guys. That's like that's like for example. And I'm gonna take myself when out of the body, rap part. I'm gonna take teachers. myself wow. and look at it and just just focus on like a different area. Like for example, they try to say Sam Smith sang better than goddamn R. Kelly. They try to say Adele sings better than Beyonce, but if um, there's Jonathan Hudson and Adele are on the same range. I actually do have Adele over Beyonce. Beyonce's not like an, an amazing yeah. singer. Beyonce is. I love Beyonce. Adele Beyonce makes all type Beyonce of music. I don't understand she's how you guys say uh, Beyonce is. First of all, she reaped the energy from ISIS, which is one of the seven races. I fuck with her all the way. I, so if you say like Jasmine Sullivan or somebody who can sing, sing, I'm with you. Jasmine Sullivan is an angry black bitter woman that makes songs about beating that asses, breaking cars, and lashing out because a nigga don't want her. I don't like that type of music all the time. Damn, that was one song. Relax. And like, they don't let black women sing like happy songs. Uh, I listen to a lot of uh, Jasmine. Jasmine Sullivan song would put me in a state of mind like, okay, 
you know what? I should have uh, did some damage to this guy. Right, Her but, songs are very depressing. But like when Adele Kelly sings is better than Beyonce. Beyonce. That's okay. Rolling in D is, 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 is it sounds like melody, but it's not. It's nothing powerful about that song. Well, Beyonce makes a very powerful song. Right. It's, it's beefing about a dude. But I'm sorry, I cut you off. But her songs are not powerful. Like Beyonce, I can name several hits that Beyonce made that is awesome. Yeah, like I'm a diva when she took the Millie beat. A, a diva is no, a female version of a hustler. I think That's Beyonce true, was reaching when she did that. <laughs> She Adele. was reaching when she did the, that song. She Adele. did. She tried to step out her element. That was a little bit too much for her. Yo, Adele, if you're not into hip hop, why do you complain about hip hop? If you're not into hip hop, what do you mean? I listen Apparently, to hip hop music, to pop and music. I have no. You know, don't. I listen to all. Listen, I listen to country music. I listen to K-pop music. I listen to reggaeton. I listen to um, tropical music. I listen to. I even listen to music to just basically meditate. I listen to all music, rap music. I have also meditate with. But hip hop is not your first choice, though. Hip hop is my first choice. I would listen no. to some goddamn mumble rap if I have to. Right, but like, so you beefing about Eminem? You listen to all these different genres of music. I don't. Understand I listen, why. but at the end of the day, it, guess what? If I was to say, okay, I'm not listening to some song that like just if I had to pick a song between Jay Z's album and Eminem, I would. Go, and I'm driving to a location like. You know, I'm on vacation. I'm gonna pick Jay Z's album and not Eminem because Eminem is gonna irritate the fuck out of me can, to where my location off is. Jay Z's last album, just any song. Jay Z album is not gonna irritate can me. Can you tell me a song off of Jay Z's last album? Any song, just random. I like a lot of Jay Z's. I like Forever Young. Forever Young. I like the song like that he made. Right? Uh, That's not his last album. <laughs> was, no, I'm not naming right? that. I'm naming all the songs that I like. I'm just asking if you can. That I listen to when I click on it. <laughs> huh? Yeah. I like that song. Um. Still a nigga. I like that song too. Four Four Four, four was overrated. Get the fuck That's out. That's a good of song, here. and it sounds good. Four 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 was a terrible was album. Awesome. Let's be honest. Like that was not a terrible it album. Really was. Like, Kendrick, I didn't listen to JV personal business. Kendrick Lamar. Like, you damn. guys are y'all gonna sit there and disagree with everybody that's a black rapper? Cause y'all fuck with Eminem. Eminem has put his nice Demi. Kendrick Earth, Lamar. Energy, all you guys, damn, and, was a better album than Four Four Four. Absolutely. Oh, I agree. Kendrick Kendrick Lamar is an awesome rapper. Kendrick Lamar raps yeah. like Eminem if he wasn't as good as he is. Yeah. <laughs> That's a damn lie. <laughs> Kendrick Lamar is not that good of a rapper. Okay, now you're getting biased. Now you just want to give Eminem credit. Hold up, is that G Money? No. Okay. <laughs> oh, all right. So, like, Kendrick, right? I was about to tackle on that net. <laughs> Kendrick is, Kendrick is uh, like one step away from no power. Kendrick, don't be talking about nothing. You said what? You don't have enough power. I don't have enough power. Because you still, I don't understand. Listen, Eminem body Jay Z on Renegade. Eminem has body Little Wayne anybody. on Forever and Drake and. And okay. Kanye. I'm How glad his little he... Demi Urge energy is making you feel oh. that way because you're being manipulated that white guy who is at no make no music to inspire hip hop at all. Adele, you fuck make white guys. You can't everybody guys guys music. Now. That doesn't make it. What? You suck white and guess what? Me and this like, it... and me and that white nigga had an argument about the same fucking thing. Well, I mean, you fucked him though. It doesn't like it doesn't count. <laughs> Look, you can't. What I fuck, I fuck white. I fuck Latino, black, Asian, whatever. I mean, that doesn't count. You can't say like, well. This white guy. But you're not going to be a white guy and try to speak on hip hop when your ass don't know nothing about hip hop. What is hip hop, Adele? You, you, don't, what is hip-hop? you don't know anything about hip hop. Not what um, Eminem made. What is hip hop? How do you define it? He has never even lived in the community to even speak on it. Yes, he has. Eminem lived up the street from me. He is a trailer park no, white boy. Eminem never, like, that's a lot of trailer Eminem parks. never lived in a trailer park. That was just a movie. Okay, yeah, right. He still know a lot about it. Really? And he did. You can tell about his young wife he lived in. His, first of all, his wife is a white bitch that got fucking brown eyeliner on her lip like she's fucking Hispanic, which she's not. And then she hates black women, too, and let alone he does. I well. believe, but, like, who cares? That's some tra- that sounds like some trailer park shit, if you ask me. I mean, well, I haven't spent much time in the trailer park. Because guess, li- guess, guess who also live in trailer parks? Uh, Mexicans. Okay. I'm not sure. You don't okay. Black How do you get here? But do, do Eminem stay in an actual black community? He used to. He's from no, the hood. Never. What are you talking about? Bam. You don't know. Never. He's from the hood. You, I'm glad his, his little I'm glad his little Demi Urge uh, energy made you. I don't believe that's like saying, it. oh yeah, that's how many people that saying that Eminem's a good rapper with people that actually probably voted for Bill Clinton. Who's that? And say he was all for black Bam. people. Who's, oh, hold on. Who's Eminem who's 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 from the hood? I'm not taking it. Half of these black people that say Eminem's a good rapper. Who who's that? Who that G? Joe said G Money. Joe or G said that. 
Joe said I Eminem said that, and he said that he can confirm it because he Eminem is not from the fucking. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> what 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 hood, what, hold, hold, what hood is he from in Detroit? Is that is, is that G, G from Atlanta? Is, is that, <laughs> is that nah, I'm G say from the or did Joey say that? Bro, I, I, I don't Detroit. have to be from Detroit to know Eminem grew up in the hood. It's obvious. <laughs> he's not from the hood. He said he's from the Taylor Park. First of all, Taylor Park, Taylor Park, Taylor Park, Taylor Park. Eastside Joey, uh, is Eminem from the hood out there? Yes, he is actually seven mile in Novara. Exactly. No, he's not. He's oh, hold, hold on, hold on, where, where, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Where he grew up? Where seven mile in what? Seven mile in Novara. Seven mile in Melbourne. Pardon me. I I I I I, I, my, I got an East Coast accent. Hey, you, he, you say he from seven hey, mile in Melbourne? M e l b o u r n e? No, it's Novara. N o v a r a. Oh, seven, seven. Hey, hey, Joey! They never heard encore album when he's. Oh when no, he I'm not talking seven. about his. I'm talking about his specific hood. He, he from Seven Mile No Bar. Right, talking his background. That one nine nine Dresden address. Like, look it up. No, no. So, so, right, so, 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 so is, is that the East Side? Yeah, it is. All right, and then, and then, so he he didn't grow he didn't grow up across Eight Mile. Mm, as far as I Easy know, he to... a lot of moves. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hold on, he, he didn't, didn't grow a lot of moves. Now, what I know hold is like. No, no, hold on, hold on. Did he grow across? Did he grow? Cause, uh, cause I, did he grow across the other turn, side of yo, eight mile? Turn, turn your mic. Right. Turn your mic down. Turn your mic down. Did he grow up on the other side of eight mile? <laughs> All right. So what are you asking? If was he ever like? Did he ever not live in Detroit? Probably. Like, in fact, he's originally from fucking Missouri or some shit. Not really oh, important. Like, we know him. He's a trailer park white boy. Oh, we know him from Detroit. Answer my bad. Go ahead. <laughs> we know Eminem from being from Detroit. So like, he done moved around a bunch. Like hey, Adele, your oh, favorite rapper. Dude, you I, said, I heard people from Detroit say that Eminem not even from the hood at all. You said you said you like Joe Button. Is no. Joe Button? Is Joe Button from the? Is Joe Button from the hood? I, I ain't, no, no, no. Joe Joe Button. Angry ass. First of all, Jay, Joe, he's not. He's a little angry ass man. Right. Nah, j- j- nah, he, he's from he's from he's from Newark, New Jersey. But you can still be from the hood and be but, sheltered. And that's the hood. You can still be from the hood and be sheltered. But I had never heard anyone that said Eminem, Eminem was from the hood in Detroit until now. Because he never said that same thing. You gotta think, though, Eminem's, been think Eminem's been famous since like 97, 98, right? Right, but what about y'all? Y'all don't even the damn hood. So, y'all don't even So, like, I'm saying, you ain't been in the hood for a minute. Because I could have sworn a boy grew up across. You never live. What is your definition of a hood? We need to see what's your definition of a hood. Fam, I'm from Detroit. I am the definition of hood. What the fuck are you talking about? Why would he lie? Because I don't understand. His Detroit epitomized what hood is. Like, I just didn't know. I just didn't know. I ain't never heard nobody say Eminem was from the hood over there. Like, I know we still. Nobody never said Eminem that. I never heard he grew up on Seven Mile, neither. I always thought he was across across the other side on Eight Mile. He said that too. That's what I thought too. That's why when he said he's from Seven Mile to where I'm like, he said he was a trailer park white boy. He grew up on the Eight Miles. And all that he never said he lived in the hood. He, he didn't. He, he can't speak on it. He speak on white boy issues. Right, he speak on white boy issues. All the songs where he said he was from the hood in reverse order. He, uh, the trailer park technically is kind of hood, okay, but so it's not hood. Okay, so we're gonna start with music to be murdered by. There's a song called "You Gonna Learn" where he's dissing T Grizzly. Listen to the song. He's actually talking. The trailer park is the hood, but it's not like a black. Where is the trailer parks in Detroit? They, are, they don't exist. There are no trailer parks in Detroit. I promise you. Oh, all of them are outside of Detroit. Man. All of them are outside of the city. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. He cleaned that up real. I was about to say, this trailer park's out there, but the yeah, outside right. of Detroit City. They're not out there they're outside of Detroit City. Right. But if he's on the other side of 8 Mile, that's not Detroit no more. Neither, though. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> what I'm saying is that he's actually from inside of the city, though. He's not he's from the hood. It is so. That's why he speak on. He do red. He, he does red. He, he, he speaks politics. Right? That's why he's from the hood. Eight miles mile is the border. Like, across eight miles is, like, when you start getting to the <laughs> suburb. But, like, just because you go across eight miles, don't mean it's all peach and green on that side. Neither, though. But, like, he, he I mean, was not white boy, It used to be that way. But, like, no, that's not what I'm saying. Because, like... <laughs> he was a poor white boy. I give you that, but I'm, I, you're not going to tell me he grew up on the red zone on the east side, like in that hood part. Like, not. 
But guess what? So is redneck white boys. Redneck white boys be posting. Like, what? Make them the, uh, Here's the thing. White boys are safe in the hood, more, more or less. Like, you can walk through the streets in the hood and be a white boy. Like, ain't nobody really gonna fuck with you because the police gonna fuck you. No, if they, they, that's a lie. Adele, not down where I live at. Adele, how you hood and you not from the hood, Adele? How are you speaking on the hood? Because I dated guys in the hood and I've done took, I done seen, my boy, my baby daddy lied one time and told me she one lied. time, oh, I've never been with a hood guy. And, yes, never I have been with a white guy. guy. And I dated guys that were in the hood. Yes, I did. When I was young, I did. Nah. I did that guy. Right, how many people? Oh, in fact, I dated right a guy that that lived in the hood and lived in the hood that actually made it to gangland. Cool. So how many of you guys actually live in the hood right now? <laughs> huh? Any of you guys actually live in the hood right now? Uh, I, I, no. I, I, do you stay in the hood right now? I, I do, but no, my hood I is, I, my hood is considered downtown Center City Philly now. So my hood is gentrified now. But I still, it was the hood originally, I, but. I right, so you've been in the hood, right? So you know how, like, when the white boys come through, like, y'all ever have Mormons come through on bikes and shit? Uh, what do you mean within, like, the last 10 years? Yeah. I mean, my hood is just your right now. It's all white people now. I ain't more white people in my hood. Let's talk about 10 years ago. Like, you ever had, like, that one white family? Yeah, right. The, the Mormons come through, right? Don't nobody mess with them dudes. That's what I'm saying. Like, white boys is more or less safe. It's different for white boys. Okay, so you... Talk about saying, oh, true, true, true. Look, look at the example. Takashi 69 was doing stuff in the hood. People said that. Like, he said that rat everybody ass out. So is he a hood nigga too? Hold on, say that again. Uh, far as the example, Takashi 69, he grew up supposedly in the hood, and and which was in the, when they found out he didn't, he was actually a suburb kid as well. Cool. But he was all in the hood and getting all this respect from niggas in the hood. So that's the same thing. How you want to compare that to Eminem? Yeah, you miss all of that. Can we Who? get back to his music? We don't care where he's from at the end of the day. But it does. We, um, he does white boy. Adele is trying to white boy love talking him. about government. Adele, Adele, you going by the singles. You haven't ever I have heard Eminem, a whole Eminem, Eminem album. I did grow up on the time Eminem's album came out. I didn't listen to Eminem after they was always trash. Every time I hear one thing that sounds groupy, I skip it. Right, right, right. No. That's what anybody else would do. If you You're cut lying. on somebody's song and say, "Who? This song is garbage." Let me skip this. You're not gonna listen to a whole damn song. Name three no songs from the that. Eminem. Name three songs from the Eminem show. I'm not an Eminem fan. So I don't. Yeah, I, I mean, know, like I said, I the only thing I know of Eminem is music three, is the that. music that he put on the air. I don't exactly. like Eminem. You heard "Without Me" and then buy the album. Just say that. That's all. I never bought his album. Exactly. So you can't speak on the song if they not singles. That I don't like. You're only judging it by the singles. Exactly. But that the singles that will make you buy the album. Song, whatever, whatever. No, that that's false. That's that's false. false. And that was like the biggest single that year, though. Like, without me, it's really fucking popular. Yeah, because the white people had, white people had love it because they thought that was creative. Yeah, that's why. people liked it, too. I remember that year. Hey, I live in the uh, summer. Like I say, wait, a lot of black boys grew up around them. Hey Joe, you can't debate with none hip hop. Man, like I remember seeing that. You said you don't even hold on. Wait, wait, wait. You said that I'm not knocking hip hop with your ass, and so you don't listen to eighties rap. So how can I basically take? Can you name an eighties rapper? Ooh, she's uh, that cute. Negative. Of course we both not. So you don't listen to eighties rap either. Dipping on that We don't even. That's like for example, like I don't like for example. I'm gonna be honest. I can't name nothing from the nineties. Adele, so how are you questioning my knowledge of something just because I don't listen so, to it? If you don't listen to I'm it, questioning your knowledge because you, just like I said, I don't listen to all of his music. I just listen to what I, he's not my favorite rapper. So if you don't listen to Adele, well, your favorite not, rapper like is him. trash. And it's you know, like, that means you don't listen to Rock Him. Right? You don't listen to anybody that's. Yeah, really. but like, I feel so like I'm not alone there, though. Like, about people you don't listen to, you don't even listen to rap guys, the real rap guys. How about you guys currently want a real rap guy? Uh, rock him. When's the last time anybody on here listened to a rock him record? Has it been more than a year? You know how old rock him is. He don't pay his dues. Like, I mean, think about the time when my hip hop was even hard to get on. Who's the rap guys, Adele? Not Eminem. Rock him. That's who. Hold on, some. Some wait. Some about some of y'all. Some of y'all got Eminem as a rap guy. I do. I guess so. Who who said that? Joe said that. D Lane. Who? Joe. He's he's in my top five. Yeah, right. he's he's he's, he's, he's biased. He's from Detroit. I allow that. I mean, I, I, he's in my he's in my top five. Okay, he's, top five. Top. he's in my top five. Let me, five. Let me holla, 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 holla. Let me, that's a good damn question right there. You like him so bad because he's from the. What has Eminem ever did for anything in your hood and your family at all? As of now, answer that question. Ooh. But you're so inspired by him. Let's talk about it. Ooh. Ooh. Answer, answer, answer. answer. All of the rappers who ever come from Detroit. Hey, Adele. 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 I don't care if it's a Mumble rapper. I can name several Mumble rappers that went to their hood and gave them Mumble rappers. Answer, let no answer. You got a little answer. Okay, every rapper from Detroit who's ever made it has has a song Eminem, correct? 
Everybody who came after him. There's okay. nothing for the community. Except, except, except. Wait, are we talking about like handing out turkeys and shit? Like, what are we doing? Because Eminem does coast the kids every year. <laughs> I mean, what are we talking about here? Hmm? Name the top. Have anyone ever seen Eminem? You want to talk about hundred people? Hey, anything? All right, support it. Hey, Adele, where you from again? North Carolina. Yeah, I live in Charlotte. You, you from there? No, I, I see from San Diego. All right, so what? Did, what the baby so you from San Diego? Okay. So you have no reference from? Oh, uh, the baby did a lot of shit for our hood. I don't see the baby be always breaking bread for one mm. thing. The baby was the reason why all these homeless people what, what, what has What has P D Pablo ever that. done? What has P D Pablo the ever done? How do I? The baby has also bought homeless people tents for this quarantine. You homeless people tents. Trash. That's okay. It doesn't matter. I can still. You can name even Atlanta. You can You're name people that I have bro. actually grew up in the community and they actually spent and broke bread with the community. Eminem never did nothing for none of you guys I at all. How do you know? Do you live in Well, name it. Name something. That he has done for your community. Coast hey. the kids. What up? How do you know? Coast the kids it. every year, at least for 15 years. What's up? Cause let alone Eminem won't even let his daughter date a black man. So let's try that. Now try Eminem's again. daughter looks like Eminem though. I'm not fucking Haley ever. Ugh. Who cares? She's not an ugly she girl. Is. She's not an ugly girl. Yes, she kid. is. No, yes, she not. is. She's not. Damn. I I'm not calling her daughter, not, daughter ugly. Let's leave the kids out there. No, she grown now. She ain't got no kind of ass. She looks like a dude. But guess what? As many thirsty black men are like white women, of course they're gonna fuck a, a flat white bitch with, with some oh. money and that got no ass. I don't care about that shit. When do y'all care about that now? I mean, I don't fuck white women at all, but like... Hell, Sam, Sam over here be wanna eat the drawers and the ass. I'm but white you woman. be eating white man ass, so like, what's the difference? I never ate a white man's ass ever, and I would never submit to a white man to eat his ass. He gonna eat my ass, because wow. he gonna submit to me. You the one that don't have a soul. I do. So you get you you, you bow like to me. Soul. I'm not bowing to you. Hey, look, I I I, I ain't here for none of all that weirdness. I was just joking. Like I don't really. It's not weirdness, but any dude, I don't care what race or what you are, you're going to do what the fuck I want. I don't know who she thinks she's talking to. I ain't submitting to nobody. I'm a grown ass man. You got me fucked up. What? <laughs> but... Something wrong with her, man. Like the thing is, she's compensating, she's right? Because a lot of people do that. Like people went really from the hood, they'd be like. Oh, extra hood. Who's extra you, hood? Like you extra into the black. I'm hood. not from the hood. You, I, that's what I'm saying. Like why I'm do not you have an hood. opinion? On I the told hood. you. I have white homegirls. Okay. I go to Starbucks. So you should be the I biggest eat, Eminem like, fan like, ever. Then you sound like a Cushy. cow. I never, I never was no goddamn you Eminem fan be, ever. He made music for you, but people never. live like you. He didn't make music. I'm, I don't hate my goddamn mama. I love my oh, mama. Oh, well, really? Wait, that's not the only type of song he makes. That's that's you. Everybody didn't grow up with their family. Everybody didn't grow up with their mom and dad. And guess what? Guess who, guess who can also... My baby daddy didn't have a dad. He had a mom. So that lifestyle reflects on okay. his dad. Okay. I didn't have neither. I all. didn't have neither. So what's up? I didn't have but neither. But guess what my baby daddy grew up in? Fucking trailer park. Man, you can't. You, 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 you hate you <laughs> hate on his top. Right, hey, let's get back to the music, music out for those who can. He's relate. not putting me down because he still has yet to name anything that Eminem does for his community. But I can name several people that does. I just named like all that shit, like all the rappers who. I can even name some mumble I rappers. Was... I can name some mumble rappers that did for the community. Like what are we what are we looking for here? Like I didn't know I look up to rappers like. Because you didn't know you didn't know. Talking about music. Who cares what somebody did for the community? Yeah. Obama is a people that actually uh, like Eminem actually vote for Eminem Obama. did more for my hood than Obama did, and we voted for Obama. Okay, Eminem, hold on, Obama is biracial well, we too. Eminem is a Democrat. Eminem is a Democrat. Eminem is a Democrat. Eminem is a Democrat. We voted for Obama. Eminem doesn't. Care. So who cares? My point is, like, why would we expect it? You vote for Obama, but yeah, oh, you have a problem oh, with making money and did, Barack did, Obama did, supports did, that. Did you say, who said, Joey, you said Eminem did more to the hood than Obama did? Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> you you, you, you going to stand on that? You, you oh, my God. God. He's reaching. Are, are you going to stand on that, sir? That's a, that's a hill I'll die on. I swear to God.